13 year old girl has become the innocent victim of Sydney's escalating gang wars, shot in the back during a confrontation at Blacktown. Detectives are searching for a link between this latest attack and a string of shootings. The teenager is in a stable condition in Westmead Hospital after being shot at her home at Blacktown. Police say three men, one armed with a shotgun, went to the house in Sunny Holt Road demanding entry. After a brief argument, the man inside shut the door. Seconds later, a volley of shots struck the building and the young girl. I think our greatest fears have now been, have now been reached with an innocent person, a 13-year-old girl, has now become a victim of this type of, of senseless activity. Like I heard four gunshots and then straight after the gunshots I heard um, some, a lady screaming and a guy shouting and they were just yelling at each other. A woman and her two sons also in the house escaped injury as the projectiles ripped into the building. Police believe the shooting could have ended in murder if the intended victim had been at home. In other incidents, shots have been fired at a car after a road rage confrontation at Riverwood and at Granville, police discovered a bullet hole at a house when they went there on unrelated matters. I think the public are quite uh, are over the, these public sort of shootings. Horrible. I was crying. I was like, that's just horrible. Really, really bad. I don't know why they would do that in the first place. The latest attacks come after a series of shootings in the past fortnight in the southwestern and western suburbs that has left two men dead, another injured, and a city rapidly beginning to fear open gang warfare on its streets. Terry Galloway, Sky News.